local cuisine helps define a place's identity. And sure, Idaho's known for potatoes, but it's also known for a very unique beef recipe that points to creativity and great taste. Of course, I'm talking about finger steaks. I spoke to a local chef to find out what makes finger steaks one of Idaho's best kept secrets. So Josh, tell me a little bit about your family history. How long has your family been in Idaho? And how long have you been making finger steaks? We've been making them since uh, 1994, so about 26 years now since we bought the drive-in. Um, and the drive-in's been uh, pretty, pretty uh, unique and you know, a, a big deal in our family. And Chef Lou, he uh, grew up down the street from the original on 21st Street uh, and then left for some time. And then we came back in, uh, in 1989 and, um, you know, a few years later, then we, we bought the West Side. But this finger steak recipe, though, over two decades invested in it. So you know it's a great finger steak and you guys know a thing or two about finger steaks. So tell me, what do you think it is, though, about a finger steak that makes it so delicious that people actually seek it out? Well, I think most importantly, you have to make them fresh to order. There's a lot of frozen options. You know, what we have found is that you want it to be tender after it's cooked and not so tough, not too shrunk, separating from the breading. And, uh, you know, you need to be able to prep it, and cut it against the grain correctly so it's not stringy or pulling when you try and take a bite out of it. We use a terrace major or a, sh a shoulder tender. Oh. It comes from the uh, shoulder chuck region of the cow. Um, it's not tough, tough like a chuck but it's it's perfect it's a nice tender juicy cut delicious okay so that beef cut essential to having that fantastic finger steak and you know it's unique to idaho but i'm not sure how many pe people realize how unique it is i know you had a special experience that was kind of an aha moment for you yeah grown up you know it's a, we're in our own little bubble around here it's not too foreign for an idahoan to know about finger steaks um but a yeah big aha moment for me was back in 2009 when guy fieri came and um, we were grateful enough to be on his show diners drivings and dives and and uh somebody of his caliber is it was quite an um, eye-opening experience for me because he was so so surprised and um had never heard of a finger steak and was pretty dumbfounded. So somebody like him um, kind of made me think, wow, this, it is a pretty unique dish. Yeah, it's one of Idaho's best kept secrets, right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Not so long though, <laughs> apparently. I know. <laughs> and I know people can go to Westside Drive-In and enjoy a really great finger steak, but they can also adventure, try to make one of their own at home. So where should they go for that recipe? So you can go to idbeef.org. Uh, there's good recipe on there and you can use that for you know other meat options as well, but it, it's a great recipe there. Excellent. Chef Josh Aaron, thank you so much for your time. Greatly appreciate it. And thank you for dedicating so much to finger steaks. Of course. Thanks, Melissa. Appreciate it.